Thinking of going keto? Then you'll want to enter into a state of ketosis, which is the best way to lose weight quickly. All those Instagram accounts showing rapid weight loss results with ketogenic diet followers shedding 20, 30, or even 50 pounds of body weight wouldn't be possible without ketosis. There are plenty of guidelines out there showing you how to shop and what to eat while following a keto diet. But one resource that's lacking is a firm plan showing exactly how you can get your body into a state of ketosis. In order to achieve it, you'll need to take a few simple steps. What is the keto diet? The keto diet is exploding in popularity, and rightfully so. People from average citizens to celebrities are quickly jumping on the bandwagon. Weight loss is quick and dramatic for so many people and some may experience reduced symptoms of chronic conditions like diabetes. When you follow a keto diet, you avoid processed foods, grains, sugar, fruit, and tuber vegetables, potatoes, yams, etc. So what can you eat? Meat, especially fatty red meat and organ meat, fish, eggs, leafy greens, low-carb vegetables, nuts and seeds, high-fat dairy, avocados, and berries. The ideal keto diet is heavily focused on fat and low on carbohydrates. When following the keto diet, you should be consuming 70% fat, 25% protein, and 5% carbohydrates. What is ketosis? Unlike other popular low-carb diets, like the Atkins diet, the ketogenic diet is all about entering a state of ketosis. What is this magical state that helps you shed excess pounds rapidly? It's a lot less complicated than you think. According to the dictionary, ketosis is, a metabolic state characterized by raised levels of ketone bodies in the body tissues. When your body is in ketosis, it uses fat for energy rather than carbs, which can help you lose weight faster. Ketosis can have other health benefits too, like reducing episodes of seizures in children. In fact, the keto diet was originally designed for epileptic children. How to get into ketosis Getting into a state of ketosis is as easy as following the rules of the diet without cheating. Here are some simple tips to help you get into ketosis quickly. Restrict carbohydrates The most important thing you can do to enter ketosis is to stop eating carbs. Your body naturally uses carbohydrates as an energy source, but when you restrict them, your body has to find alternative options. That's why cutting carbs down as much as possible automatically helps you reach ketosis. Restrict protein One of the most common keto diet mistakes is eating too much protein and too little fat. After all, it's easier to find protein sources than it is to subsist on healthy fats. Followers of the Atkins diet typically eat too much protein when they're trying to stay keto. Avoiding fat your whole life you've been taught that fat makes you fat. Eating keto means pivoting from this line of thinking and eating more fat than most people are comfortable with. In order to follow the keto diet, you need to stop thinking of fat as the enemy and start embracing healthy fats like avocados, red meat, fish, and coconut oil. Skip your snacks Snacking on anything, even keto-compliant foods, leads to constant insulin spikes that can prevent you from entering ketosis. Stick to eating three, or fewer, meals per day and stop eating in between. Thankfully, you won't be as hungry as often if you follow the rule of eating mostly high-fat foods. Try fasting Intermittent fasting and the keto diet go hand in hand. There are many ways to experiment with fasting that don't involve excessive hunger. Choose the method that's best for you, start slow, and find out how fasting can help you reach your goals of ketosis. Drink water it doesn't matter what the question is, drink more water is almost always the answer. So many keto diet followers neglect drinking water and it's a huge mistake. Staying hydrated helps you stay fuller, eat less, and helps your organs function better, too. While following the keto diet, you should aim to drink a gallon of water per day, minimum. The keto diet has plenty of critics, but the people who follow it are experiencing undeniable weight loss and health results. It may not be for everyone, but once you try keto, you may love it. Getting into ketosis just makes it all worthwhile. These are the 15 healthiest ice creams you can eat. Welcome to the future, where you can have ice cream that's delicious and healthy.
or, at least, you can have ice cream that's not as bad as it used to be. So clear out your freezer and stockpile these surprisingly healthy ice cream treats that taste as good as they look. Ciao Bella Sicilian Pistachio Gelato Gelato is essentially Italian ice cream. Churned at a slower rate, it tends to have more milk and less cream than ice cream. At 240 calories per serving, this denser treat will help you feel full thanks to the real pistachios. Each serving has less sugar than other types of gelato on the market. Nadamu. Gotta do chocolate ice cream there's a lot to love here. First, it's non-dairy and organic. Next, there are only 120 calories per serving. Unlike other low-calorie ice creams that add extra ingredients for flavor, this Nadamu dessert has only 8 grams of sugar per serving. It also has a whopping 6 grams of fiber, more than an apple, and 1 gram of protein. Skinny Cow Salt Kissed Caramel Greek Yogurt Bars You know Greek yogurt is good for you, but did you know it's just as good for you frozen? These 100-calorie Greek yogurt bars are deliciously creamy and perfect for caramel lovers. Bonus, each bar contains active and live cultures plus 5 grams of protein. Coconut Bliss Sweet Cherry Amaretto Ice Cream made from coconut milk is a great way to consume healthy fats. With a higher fat content than regular ice cream, coconut milk ice cream gives you the good type of fat that raises HDL cholesterol. This particular flavor is refreshing and creamy, with 260 calories per serving, 1 gram of fiber, and 2 grams of protein. Good Pop Cold Brew Coffee Pops What happens when you combine cold brew coffee with popsicles? You get Good Pops Cold Brew Coffee Pops. These delicious treats are pretty much coffee on a stick. Perfect for a pick-me-up in the summer, they have the same amount of caffeine as one cup of coffee. Each pop is only 80 calories, with 8 grams of sugar per serving. Klondike Ice Cream Bar Original Minis It's far better to indulge in small portions of your favorite treats than it is to overindulge in diet products with hidden ingredients. If you love Klondike Bars, you'll appreciate these mini versions. They're just enough to satisfy your cravings, with 120 calories in each serving. Chili Cow Brown Butter Salted Caramel Ice Cream Bars Chili Cow uses ultra-filtered milk, which essentially gets rid of the sugar and water in milk and leaves behind a denser product packed in protein. If you love ice cream bars, you can enjoy one of these at just 100 calories. You can also buy this flavor in pint form. Yasso Coffee Chocolate Chip Frozen Greek Yogurt Bars If you want a cold, caffeine-filled treat that tastes more like ice cream than coffee, try these coffee chocolate chip Greek yogurt bars from Yasso. This frozen treat still gives you a caffeine buzz without all that coffee. Plus, Greek yogurt provides more protein than ice cream. Each bar has 100 calories and 5 grams of protein. Cardo Dairy Free Simply Lemon Avocado Frozen Dessert If you seek a dairy-free ice cream with a unique taste, we've got the solution. Cardo's Lemon Avocado Frozen Dessert is creamy, thanks to the avocado puree, and refreshing, due to the crisp lemon flavor. It's a combo you'd never think of, but once you try it you'll see why it's on our list. It comes in a pint, and each serving has just 170 calories. Talenty Gelato Chocolate Fudge Swell Dense, Creamy Gelato can help you feel more satisfied than regular ice cream. Talenty's Chocolate Fudge Swell flavor has more natural ingredients and fewer calories than other flavors. Each serving has 160 calories, 8 grams of fiber, and 5 grams of protein. Good Humor Strawberry Shortcake Bars This childhood throwback is surprisingly healthier than several ice creams that market themselves as diet or healthy options. Each Good Humor Strawberry Shortcake Bar has just 160 calories and 11 grams of sugar. Treat yourself and enjoy a delicious treat with a sense of nostalgia. Chloe's Soft Serve Fruit Co. Mango Pops These soft-serve mango pops have just three ingredients, fruit, water, and cane sugar. That means you don't have to worry about bad ingredients. Be careful because they're fairly high in sugar. One serving has only 60 calories but 15 grams of sugar. Halo Top Pops Chocolate Chip Cookie Dough We aren't sure exactly how they do it, but Halo Top manages to make delicious ice cream pops with only 50 calories. 
you can indulge in a variety of flavors, like cookie dough, mint chocolate chip, peanut butter swell, and strawberry cheesecake. Enlightened s'mores If you love the taste of s'mores but don't want to sit by a campfire all night, you're in luck. Enlightened s'mores ice cream tastes just like the real thing. At just 100 calories per serving, this treat starts with creamy marshmallow and adds real chunks of graham crackers and chocolate. Edie's Slow Churned Mint Chocolate Chip Ice Cream Slow Churned Ice Creams are ideal for those who want a larger bowl of dessert with fewer calories. That's because it's made at a lower temperature than traditional ice creams, lowering the size of fat particles. Edie's Slow Churned Mint Chocolate Chip Flavor is just 110 calories per serving. Surprising ways the beach affects your body it's summertime, and this means we're headed to the beach, or at least dreaming of it. Many of us overlook the health benefits of a little bit of sunshine. If you're already planning a trip to the beach, this list will help you make up your mind. Plus, we'll learn how the beach affects your body negatively, too. The good, stress relief we all know the sights and sounds of the beach work together to relieve stress. But what's going on in your body physiologically is amazing. When you go to the beach, you get a release of serotonin, which is a hormone that makes you feel happy. Fight off infection Maybe you've heard the myth that salt water can help heal a cut or infection. But this actually a fact. Even the medical community advises treating minor skin infections with salt water soaks or compresses. Both antibacterial and antifungal, salt water helps with thyroid gland health, too. What better way to treat a minor infection than playing in the ocean? Daily dose of vitamin D Hopefully, if you take a trip to the beach, you'll experience sunny days in the sand, and quickly get your daily dose of vitamin D. This vitamin is an essential one. And amazingly, our body creates it from exposure to direct sunlight UVB rays. You don't have to get a tan or a burn to get vitamin D. It only takes about half the time it takes to burn to get the needed amount. Skin health Now before you take this as a license to bake your skin, slather on SPF or use an umbrella. Thankfully, there are other ways the beach is good for your skin. First of all, sand is a fantastic exfoliant for your feet. Being in the sun opens your pores, too. When you follow that with a plunge in the salt water, it can clear out acne-causing bacteria. Better sleep You don't have to play with the intensity of a child to get the positive sleep effects of the beach. Just a walk on the beach is hard work because of the stability it takes to walk on sand. And when your body is tired, you sleep better. Plus, less stress helps with a better night's sleep, too. Breathe more easily It's no wonder many people retire to beach communities. But one reason why, knowingly or unknowingly, is the beach's air quality. People with asthma, COPD, and other breathing issues thrive here. The Lung Institute reports that people with chronic lung conditions had clearer lungs after breathing the salt air at the beach for nearly a year. Regulate your body with iodine We know iodine is essential to our bodies because it's added to our salt. Our bodies need iodine to create thyroid hormones, which control our metabolism and many other vital body functions. And your skin absorbs the iodine present in the ocean when you take a swim in the water. The bad, sunburn Most people can relate to the experience of a bad sunburn. If you are in and out of the water a lot, even if you reapply sunscreen, it will wash off. Check out this list of the best waterproof sunscreens. Alternate spending time in the sun and shade, so your skin isn't baking all day. And find a fun hat to provide lots of shade to your face, neck, and shoulders. Sun damage to your skin wrinkles and age spots are inevitable. But spending time in the sun ages your skin more rapidly. According to the American Academy of Dermatology, every time you go out in the sun without protection, your skin is exposed to UV rays. You can protect your skin by keeping it covered, staying in the shade, and using sunscreen. Your dermatologist can also help with treatments to reverse the effects of sun damage. Dehydration It seems crazy to get dehydrated as all that water surrounds you. But it's easy when you are in the sun all day. Drink 16 ounces of water an hour when you're at the beach, and you should be good to go. Also, if you feel like you're overdoing it, get in the shade and drink something with electrolytes right away. 
jellyfish stings and other first aid concerns any fun outing has associated health risks. But there are plenty of ways to avoid the risks and be prepared if anything unfortunate does happen. Always bring a first aid kit to deal with scrapes and cuts. Make sure you know how to treat a jellyfish sting. Be smart and don't swim outside of your ability. Be aware of any undertoes. If you're at the beach with children, consider a beach spot with a lifeguard. 15 foods to nourish your brain Many people think a decline in brain function is a natural part of aging. However, a well-nourished noggin is better able to aid every other system in your body. No matter your age, your brain will be sharper if you feed it right. The following foods, full of antioxidants, flavonoids, and other bioactive compounds, will nourish your brain throughout your lifetime. 1. Avocados The monounsaturated fat in avocados contributes to healthy blood flow and, according to Ann Kultzer, MD. Healthy blood flow means a healthy brain. Avocados also help lower blood pressure, which is good since hypertension is a risk factor in cognitive decline. Avocados are high in calories, so enjoy one quarter to one half of an avocado per day. Olive oil is another option for adding healthy monounsaturated fats to your diet. Next, humble pantry staples that pack a powerful punch. 2. Beans legumes help stabilize blood glucose levels. Since the brain relies on glucose for fuel and can't store it, the organ depends on foods like beans for a steady fuel supply. All legumes, especially lentils, are rich in folate, which protects brain cells from amino acids that impair brain functions. Half a cup of beans or lentils per day will fuel your brain. If you hate beans, try baking delicious black bean brownies. Next, savor a touch of sweetness. 3. Dark chocolate savor up to one ounce of dark chocolate daily and you'll consume powerful antioxidants along with mood-enhancing endorphins. Non-Dutch process cocoa is also rich in flavonoids that can improve blood flow to the brain. The caffeine and other natural stimulants that dark chocolate contains can improve your concentration, too. Just enjoy in moderation. Next, enjoy your morning cup. 4. Coffee Coffee is good for your brain. Studies show the drinks phenylindanes may reduce the risk of disorders like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. In fact, coffee often supplies the majority of antioxidants in a person's diet. It actually contains more essential antioxidants than green tea. Remember, drink it in moderation, 1 to 3 cups a day. And skip the creamers and sweeteners that add unnecessary fat and calories. Next, add color to your meals. 5. Colorful fruits and vegetables Richly colored fruits and vegetables, like beets, blackberries, berries, carrots, watermelons, green beans, kiwis, plums, pumpkin, sweet potatoes, and tomatoes have high levels of antioxidants. This protects against the oxidative stress caused by free radicals, which is vital for a healthy brain. Antioxidants also improve communication between brain cells. Beets contain natural nitrates that improve blood flow in the brain, and a flavonoid in berries called anthocyanidin concentrates in the hippocampus, where memory and learning occur. This flavonoid also protects brain cells from the aging effects of oxidation and inflammation. Dark, leafy greens provide more nutrition and antioxidants than many other vegetables. The USDA advises eating at least two to three servings per week to lower your cancer risk. Common dark, leafy greens include beet greens, endive, lettuce, microgreens, spinach, and Swiss chard. Next, mom was right all along. 6. Cruciferous vegetables Your mom was right when said to eat your broccoli. Most vegetables are nutrition powerhouses, but cruciferous types are especially nutritious. Loaded with vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants, cruciferous veggies benefit your whole body, including the brain. These are examples of cruciferous vegetables, arugula, bok choy, broccoli, Brussels sprouts, cabbage, cauliflower, collard greens, horseradish, kale, and watercress. Next, brain food from the sea. 7. Fish oily, deep water fish are rich in omega-3 fatty acids vital for proper brain function. They regulate neurotransmitters, which are key to mental focus. 
lake trout, wild salmon, albacore tuna, halibut, herring, mackerel, and sardines are great sources of fatty acids. Eat 3 to 4 ounces of these fish 2 or 3 times per week for optimal brain and heart health. 8. Pomegranate juice or fruit, co-author of the Better Brain book, Dr. David Perlmutter says, probably no part of the body is more sensitive to the damage from free radicals as the brain. Pomegranates, along with cranberries and citrus fruits, contain powerful antioxidants that fight off these free radicals. Pomegranate juice usually has added sugar. So aim for 2 ounces a day. Add it to seltzer water for a delicious sparkling drink. 9. Nori and other seaweeds, you can find this dried, edible seaweed in supermarkets that stock Asian ingredients. In addition to vitamins, minerals, protein, and fiber, seaweeds are extremely high in antioxidants. Eat nori in moderation due to its high salt and iodine content, a tablespoon per week is ample. If you aren't familiar with this seaweed, these recipes may help. Scientific research finds that reishi mushrooms have hundreds of bioactive compounds that protect the brain against neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's. They also limit the effects of strokes. Reishi mushroom's unique Ganoderma lucidum peptide protein is a potent antioxidant. The spores protect the hippocampus from issues related to diabetes. Polysaccharides and tritopenis are two other disease-fighting compounds found in these mushrooms. Take up to 1,500 mg of reishi powder per day to experience its benefits for yourself. Next, add a little texture to your food. 11. Seeds and nuts Chia, flax, and quinoa are especially nutritious. In fact, flax is the main source of alpha-linolenic acid, which helps the cerebral cortex process sensory stimuli. Pumpkin seeds are high in antioxidants as well as minerals like copper, iron, magnesium, and zinc. A study showed significant improvement in learning skills, memory, reducing anxiety, and motor development in mice fed a walnut-enriched diet. Eat an ounce a day of any combination of nuts. Next, spice things up. 12. Warm spices Warm spices like those used in baking and autumn lattes nourish and protect your brain. A study done on 26 common seasonings found that many spices contained high levels of phenolics and demonstrated high antioxidant capacity. Cinnamon topped the list with unusually high levels of phenolics. Turmeric benefits many areas of the body. And ginger improves cognitive function, an indicator of a well-nourished brain. Next, the British have this one down pat. 13. Black and green tea preferably made from loose tea, the freshly brewed drink contains potent antioxidants that benefit your brain. Many studies link black tea to a range of health benefits, including reducing the risk of stroke. Green tea is high in a type of antioxidants called catechines, which enhance blood flow throughout the body, including the brain. Enjoy two or three cups of tea every day. Next, these foods are great for your whole body. 14. Whole grains. Whole grains reduce the risk of heart disease. And a healthy heart pumps blood more efficiently throughout your body, including your brain. This type of grain is also absorbed into your system slowly, releasing brain fueling glucose over an extended period. Eat at least one half cup of oatmeal or whole grain cereal, a couple of slices of whole grain bread, or two tablespoons of wheat germ each day. While not technically a whole grain, wheat germ shares many of the same attributes. Other whole grains like barley, brown rice, bulgur, rye, wild rice, and whole wheat couscous add variety to a brain-healthy diet. Next, washing all of that goodness down. 15. Water Yes, we know water isn't technically a food, but studies show dehydration causes brain tissue to shrink, upsetting the balance of brain chemicals. Not surprising, since our brains are 85% water. A lack of water also impairs focus, decision-making, short-term memory, and long-term memory recall. 